A ceiling collapse at a Westchester Elementary School leaves hundreds of families wondering where their children will go come September. Good evening, I'm Christine Johnson. Welcome back, I'm Dick Brennan, in for Maurice Dubois. All those parents know for sure is that right now their new Rochelle school is off limits. So where will they go to class? CBS 2's Lou Young has a story new at 5.30. Hey, do you have any idea when the school's opening? Where are these kids going to go to school in two weeks, you know? Nobody knows? Yes, school starts soon, but not here at Daniel Webster Elementary in New Rochelle, where a sudden ceiling collapse in an upstairs classroom has the district scrambling for alternatives. Clock's ticking. School is right around the corner, and they haven't told anybody anything where your child's going to go. The district's last official comment was online last week saying some or all of the school will need to be temporarily relocated. That's it. Striking many is a little vague. It's unbelievable. I don't know what these parents must be going through right now. No answers. No answers. Nothing. So you don't know if your kids are going here or somewhere else? Right. At all. That's the question. Don't have a clue yet. We're talking about 500 students in the district here still trying to find a temporary home for them only weeks from the start of school. We were, however, able to get some questions answered. Listen. They won't be attending Webster Elementary in September. They'll be attending school at an alternate site. We're looking at one of three sites uh, right now. We're negotiating leases. The children will be all together at one other location. One possibility is an old Catholic school several blocks away, which is partially occupied by Iona College. If a decision is made quickly, the staff at Daniel Webster could have almost three weeks to make the move, a relatively small inconvenience considering how this could have turned out. When you look at that classroom and you see the plaster that fell through, what do you say? I'm glad that it happened in the summer. New Rochelle's doing a full inspection of all its school ceilings and rooftops. It's expected the students at Daniel Webster will be back in the building after the winter break. In New Rochelle, Lou Young, CBS 2 News. A new superintendent in New Rochelle has just begun addressing decades of deferred maintenance. And a spokesperson for the district says they knew that they needed to inspect the ceilings, but were shocked by the sudden collapse and heavy water damage. Police